This is the second video in a tutorial mini-series about counting with image J. In this video, we will manually count strawberry flowers and fruits. For this example, we're going to use the Fiji version of image J to count the number of strawberry fruits and flowers in a photograph of strawberry plants in the field. We will import the image by dragging the image onto the image J graphical user interface. Um, this photograph was taken using a compact digital camera, in this case a Sony DSC RX100, in the middle of a cloudy day. In this example, we will count the number of strawberries turning red, the number of unripe white strawberries, and the number of flowers in the photograph. We will use one of um, Fiji's manual count plugins. Go ahead and go to Plugins, Analyze, Cell Counter, Cell Counter. It's going to open up a little cell counter window. Um, we have a lot of different counters right now, so we're just going to go ahead and um, click Remove a few times until we only have three. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and click Initialize. Um, that means that we can start counting. We're going to click Counter Type 1. Um, we're going to start with the red fruit, so um, go ahead and click some of these fruit. Okay, um, now we're going to go on to um, type 2, click on the white fruit. Um, now if you notice, there's actually kind of like an obvious red fruit that I kind of missed from earlier. Um, if we miss any fruit from a um, set of categories, we can always go back. I'm going to go back to um, counter type 1 and I'm going to select that. Now, if I make a selection where um, it's just kind of like obviously an inappropriate selection, like right over here, I can go ahead and go on to delete mode and then um, click it and it will delete it and then un uncheck the delete mode to go back to normal again. Uh, finally, we're also going to count the number of flowers. So that's counters type 3. Go ahead and click that. And then um, now that we've made all our accounts, we can easily transfer the count results from ImageJ to another program like Excel by um, clicking on the results. And then we can go ahead and select that and copy it. And we can put that wherever we want. Um, if we wanted to uh, export the image with the numbers on it, uh, we can go ahead and um, click Export Image and then uh, File. Um, save as, maybe TIFF, you know, whatever it is that we want. And then um, that does save a version of the image with the numbers. They're pretty small, so you have to kind of zoom in to see them, but they are there. That concludes the second movie in our mini-series about counting manually and automatically in image J. Thank you so much for watching, and hopefully we'll have another movie for you soon.